we have it totally under control. It's one person coming in from China, and we have it under control. It's uh, going to be just fine. We have very little problem in this country at this moment, five. And uh, those people are all recuperating successfully. But we're working very closely with China and other countries. How concerned are you? Well, we pretty much shut it down, coming in from China. Now, the virus that we're talking about having to do, you know, a lot of people think that goes away in April with the heat, as the heat comes in. Uh, typically, that will go away in April. We're in great shape, though. Very interestingly, uh, we've had no deaths. We have a, uh, I mean, you know, we've had a great practice. We had, we had 12 at one point, and now they've gotten very much better. Many of them are fully recovered. It is what it is. We're ready for it. We're really prepared. We have, as I said, we've had, we have the greatest people in the world. We're very ready for it. We hope it doesn't spread. There's a chance that it won't spread, too. The Obama administration made a decision on testing, and that turned out to be very detrimental to what we're doing. And we undid that decision a few days ago so that the testing can take place in a much more accurate and rapid fashion. Anybody that needs a test gets a test. We, they're there. They have the test. And the tests are beautiful. Anybody that needs a test gets a test. We will be suspending all travel from Europe to the United States for the next 30 days. The virus will not have a chance against us. No nation is more prepared or more resilient than the United States. Today, I am officially declaring a national emergency. Two very big words. And we're asking everyone to work at home if possible, postpone unnecessary travel and limit social gatherings to no more than 10 people. This is a pandemic. I felt it was a pandemic long before it was called a pandemic. All you had to do is look at other countries. I think now it's in almost 120 countries all over the world. We will be extending our guidelines to April 30th to slow the spread. This could be a hell of a bad two weeks. This is going to be a very bad two and maybe even three weeks. This is going to be three weeks like we haven't seen before. There's a monster we're fighting. But signs are that our strategy is totally working. Every American has a role to play in winning this war. And we're going to be winning it. We're going to be winning it powerfully. And we'll be prepared for the next one, should it happen. But hopefully it won't. The President of the United States calls the shots. If we weren't here for the states, you would have had a problem in this country like you've never seen before. The President of the United States, the authority is total. And that's the way it's got to be. Your authority is total. It's total. It's total. And the governors know that. The battle continues, but the data suggests that nationwide we have passed the peak on new cases. Hopefully that will continue and we will continue to make great progress. 29 states are in that ball game, not open, not for opening, but I think they'll be able to open relatively soon. I think the remainder are just getting better.